Snake, I'm sure you've noticed the dust bins used for trash collection in that area. I'll bet they're big enough to fit inside. It could come in handy if you need to stay out of sight until the coast is clear. To get inside a dustbin, stand in front of it and press the action button. Stand in front of it, press the action button. Got it. Once you're inside, tilt the six-axis wireless controller to sneak a peek outside. You can also launch a first-person attack that way. When you're ready to get out, press the action button again. Snake, I know you already know this, but there's no point in hiding if the enemy sees you doing it. Make sure no one's watching. How did it go? Did you manage to hide? Yeah, I did like you said. <sighs> Looks like this is where they dump their household trash. Hmm, huh. how can you tell? Because it stinks in here. Bad. Leftovers from last night's dinner, probably. Ooh, leftovers. Mm, and there's some bugs crawling around on my face. Ugh. It feels like roaches. There's a whole bunch of them scurrying around. Make sure you get the smell of them off you before coming back here. Yeah, I'll see what I can do. Ugh, seriously, doesn't it make you sick? I'd crawl into a toilet if it kept me out of sight. Something crawling up my leg. Ugh, I can't even imagine. Ugh. You know, you might want to get out of there as soon as the coast is clear. Yeah. Not the best place for a nap. No kidding. Avoid unnecessary combat whenever possible. In this war, neither side is your enemy. There's no point whatsoever in you getting into a fight. Got it? I've got some intel on the PMCs deployed in that area. They're a part of Praying Mantis Corporation, based out of the United Kingdom. It's one of the five largest PMCs in the world. Its business activity includes soldiers for hire, supply and logistics services, education and training for state armies, everything you'd expect. During the Iraq War, Praying Mantis contracted with the US government to send large numbers of its soldiers into combat zones, which is why the local regime opted to hire Praying Mantis, a UK-based company, and not their regular army to fight the rebels for them. They were buying their experience. You can pick 
picked up guns dropped by both the militia and the PMCs. Remember, though, PMC weapons are locked. You can't use them. If only there was some way to get rid of the locks. Snake, the PMC soldiers are using ID guns. ID guns? See how the word locked appears in the weapon list? Yeah. ID guns are equipped with locks. As long as the lock is engaged, you can't pull the trigger. Any suggestions? The locks are only disengaged when they recognize the nanomachine ID inside a soldier's body. Anyone not possessing nanomachines keyed to the system, or anyone who's keyed but not authorized to use that weapon, won't be able to pass the ID guns verification process. So I can't use PMC guns. I'm afraid not. You're not registered with the system. And it's not just weapons either. Vehicles, buildings, everything used for military purposes is secured with this ID control system. Without the proper IDs, it's impossible for PMCs or state armies to fight. Think of it as a soldier's dog tag, only at the nano level. So, I shouldn't even bother picking up ID guns. For now, at least. But they might come in handy later on. Otacon, seriously, what's with all these ads? Oh, you mean battlefield ads. Battlefield ads? Is that what they're called? On the street, anyway. It's what people are calling any ad having to do with the war economy. Privatizing the military has inevitably created intense competition for market share among PMCs and defense industries. Everybody wants to expand their market, get a bigger piece of the pie, so they're churning out truckloads of ads, exactly like the ones we see every day. But war is not something you can just write off. It may seem that way, but the war economy is an enormous... Same goes for internet ads, TV commercials. The world's gone mad. And us with it. I know. But that's reality. Rendezvous with the Mark II. I'll show you which route to take. Just do as I say. And don't forget to use Octocamo. Press the crawl button while running to execute a roll. Rolling can help you dodge enemy attacks and get past small gaps and obstacles. Take it or what? 